This has been the journey so far. The cauldron was cold, but the horseman rekindled its fire, and in the hearts of the makers an ember of hope was born. Hope for life, and for what lies beneath the earth. Hello everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Challenge Darksiders 2 Weapons Only Run. I'm your host, Let's Play Princess. In the last episode, we got the first half of the water flowing in this dungeon. I was got the fires burning because you can't have a fucking crazy blacksmith area without water and fire. Water to temper that fire out. In this episode, we're gonna begin the second half. We're gonna be doing some other shit. I like these hour long episodes because it allows me to get more shit done, it feels. And I also thought I would define what I mean by weapons only. I consider pretty much the entire inventory as weapons, armor and shit, because by the end game I would be taking, you know, fucking a hundred percent damage to my health and would be dying instantly if I didn't do it a certain way. So while I do feel it's not fair in the sense that I feel like I'm cheating some of the rules, it's not as challenging. At the same time, it is still a challenge because of the idea that I'm giving myself limitations. I can't fucking use whatever the hell it's called. The, um, the skills. But because, and the Reaper mode. I'm not going to be using Reaper mode at all. But at the same time, I decided to give myself a little bit, one more limitation that would be in an epilogue video. I will be doing, and I'll probably do this for the skill only run too, because I will be doing that. I will be doing every single secret boss. I will go back, I will use guide, and I will find every single collectible in the game. And that has to do with uh, opening up a dungeon, and I will do those side quests and shit, and get it all done. Show me the way. Now Dusk, I need your help, because I literally have no idea what I'm doing. You are telling me to go over there. Means there's still something I need to do over in this area. Either that, or I'm just crazy. But needless to say, this entire thing will not be touched. And whenever you see a run, uh, whenever I actually decide to do a skill only run, you will only pretty much be seeing these and these. But I think I explained that before. Dust, where the fuck are you trying to get me to go? I can't get that. I don't know what the hell is over here. Am I supposed to go over there? I feel like that's like a staircase I have to climb or something. It was a staircase, but I already did that. Unless that was for the lover. No, that was for the water. That was the water. and dropped me down to here, and then it brought me here, and I'm here. Which means... Oh, wait, 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 the water. If the water is filled, I can go down to the underground area. That's where I think I'm supposed to be going anyway. But yeah, I'll go back and I'll get all the collectibles. And, um, I might give myself some stat boost for those special bosses. I'll do, you know, the entire Coliseum or the arena or whatever the fuck it's called. I think it's called the Crucible. You'll, you'll see Special K beat with a weapons only run. It, it's lost. I mean, I feel like some challenge runs, like shit that Tier, uh, tier Grace does, aren't exactly hard, like a Brimstone only run or something. But the reason why it can be hard is because of the limitations. And that's what I'm seeing this more of. It's challenging not because it's an actual, like, hard thing, but because I have given myself limitations and I'm going to be completing the game via these limitations. I mean, for all I know, a follow-up three run that's, like, this only, if you give yourself shit, like, ooh, holy shit. <laughs> if you give yourself something like, you know, that, that, that super fist. 
that's it. That's like the run it feels. But if I ever did a fist only run or punching only run of Fallout 3, which I do own and I've never beaten it because I don't really like that game, but I feel like if I let's played it, it would allow me to complete, to actually finish that game through. And I would like to see the rest of that game at some point, maybe. But needless to say, the, uh, it could be easier, it could be harder, but the fact that it's a limitation makes it a challenge. I feel like any type of limitation can make anything a challenge, which is why I'm counting it. Also, let's be quite honest here. Uh, holy shit. I might die. Holy fuck. Die? Yeah. That low health might, um, be a problem. Yay! Well, let's check DeviantArt while I'm... Oh, people did things. Do I have any notes or anything? Or is it just art? Aha! It's art. One of which I don't give a shit about and the other one is... I don't know right now. No, am I gonna check? But needless to say, uh... <gasps> gotta be a fucking health potion in one of these boxes or I'm dead. This is it. And see, this is part of the limitation because if I had given myself pros or something all these fucking thingies would be distracted and it would help in a way. Oh my god, just fucking thank you. Okay, we're, we're using the health potion now. Fucking, you're dying, and you're dying, and that health potion barely did anything. Okay, come on, guys. That Y button attack is really helping me. Oh, come on! This isn't fair! Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh god. Oh god, just kill it. Okay, run. Just run. Just run. There's gotta be something. There's gotta be something. Oh god, there's nothing. Okay, we might have a problem. Okay, are you the only one left alive? Okay. I'd be very careful with this. I was not careful with that. Holy shit! What the fuck am I supposed to do here? Wait, actually, no. I have a plan. I have a plan of attack, and I don't like it. But I'm going to do it. Needless to say, I... Haha. -ha. Where is it? There we go. I fast travel... I can buy some potions and then fast travel back to that exact point in the dungeon, I think. Either that or the dungeon entrance, but even then that'd be completely fine. Yeah, that should work. Give me some potions while I'm at it. Fight Khan or whatever the fuck his name is and see how well that goes. I like this idea. This idea works. Problem. Did I lose my super armor? The answer might surprise you. It was no. Well, guess what? That, uh, that lovely hammer. How close is it to leveling up? Yeah, I think I love that. This needs an axe or hammer or whatever to level it up. Bitch, buy me see. some shit. Browse around. We have new items. You don't have anything that I need. Also, holy fuck. Huh. Wrath on crit. Fire damage. Eh. Needless to say. Nothing I can buy is actually pretty good. Except 
for maybe those. Yeah, nothing that they have is really ever good, except for Shaman Lady, because talismans are always some type of strange stat boost, and those help more than, honestly, anything in this game ever. Like, no joke. Also, I can't believe I'm buying health potions. This is a first for me. What was old is new again. Oh, shut up, lady. Yes, I'd like to buy two more. Thank you. I bought all of your health potions. As you read them, so. so, I'm also gonna try this current battle just to, you know, maybe, maybe. Not Karn, Thane? Thane. No, it's something. What the fuck is your name? Thane. Okay. Now, do you have any things I can... It's not good. Left trigger while holding down back. A useful launch attack that can send enemies over death's head? Daring forward evade. A gap closing attack meant for, dis for covering distance and slamming. Leak our enemies to the ground. Um, I mean, that's that, and then okay, hold on. That's not that. <coughs> I'm gonna check my skills. Where the hell's my skills? Oh, I check my what my things are. Ah, shit. It's over here. No. Yes. Scythes. Blah blah. blah. Earthbreaker. Amac. Ender. After five earthbreakers during tremor something, which I don't have. Press Y up to five times. Okay. I just got something. Oh, fuck me, it's a hammer thing, okay? Well, let's... I guess now see what the hell it is, right? I'm using fodder. That's... pretty cool. Not the best. But, okay. Dang. I'm gonna fight you. Come at me, bro. Oh shit, that actually hurts him. Ow. Oh, did you- Oh shit, you're free, heal? Oh, hell yeah. I'll shoot the system. Well, I'm actually putting the hurt on him. Damn it! I can't cancel out of that, that's the problem. Once I do the leap, there's no dodge, it's just a leap. So I'm pay attention to what I'm doing. Okay, I can cancel that. And then go into that. Then when he does just the, the hammer down, I can do certain things. So that's that. Oh god. Well, that's the first hit. That's not that bad. Okay. Now, I'm only doing the first hit with the gauntlets just because I can get the critical on it. And the critical is worth it to me. However, that was not worth it. Holy shit! Wait, I leveled up? 
I've... What? I have no skills. Oh, I guess I do. You know, to say I don't want it. Hey, do you do you feel like you lost, well, buddy? One should never go unrewarded. Hey, I won. You got lucky. Mayhaps I am too old to do this. Cool. Age isn't everything. You kill them all. Sounds like a challenge. So I guess that was because. Got Reaper mode. Anyway, here's a whole shit ton of extra bosses. That'll be the fucking post game. <laughs> Needless to say, I think I just won his battle. So the reason why I got Reaper mode is because I leveled up because. What? I finished his side quest and I supposedly beat him even though I actually didn't finish the battle? Arkal! Sure. Idiots. Oh, only show me fucking tri stone, huh? Okay, fine. Fuck here. Ha ha ha! I win. Plus, I got a free level up, which means bosses should be less intimidating? No, that's not true. That was a savage stalker. They can only be intimidating. Like, super intimidating. Like, I can't believe this mode's not done. Intimidating. Oh, that's. Kinda cute. It's Naruto as a frog creature thingy. Somebody fucking noted me on a thingy. Oh, it was that person. Cool. Probably shouldn't be talking about DA shit. <clears throat> okay, let's do this. Also, guns don't do anything. Guns are really only used for the walk thingies and the thingies. Watch, I'll even use the gun. I'll do the pew pews. Say nothing. Oh, Brent, we're gonna use this because holy shit, is it good! There we go. There we go. I'm happy with this. This result's pretty good. I'm taking less damage, which either means I healed really well, or that defense up on the fucking thingy was actually... on the level up was really good. Needless to say, I'm taking that. I'm not the four, which makes me happy. This guy, however, does not make me happy. In fact, I'm gonna try to stay away from him. Yep. Okay. Nope. Let's stay away. Let's learn about this. Let's think about this, dude. I don't want to fight you, you don't want to fight me. Haha, -ha, maybe. Shit, why did I not equip those? Fuck. Mid-battle change of armor and shit, because I'm stupid. How much better is it? Oh. Yeah, fuck my strength. I'd rather not die. Suck, homie. Haha, -ha, you idiot. Dickhead. Okay, nope, now you're pissed. Okay, I'll heal. I'm really liking these gauntlets! They're pretty fucking good! Okay, now he's gonna do that thingy that I don't like. Well. I didn't go as bad as I thought it was going to. Should give me a health potion. Do not give me a health potion. These suck. And that was the only door. No chests, nothing. Only equipment I got was shit. Come here to Dark Avenger. Locked door. Requires a key. Like most locked door. Oh, this area. I remember this puzzle fucking being a pain, which means it's probably not a pain. I was just retarded earlier in my life. We. There should be a monster. I heard a monster. There it is. Hello. Oh, 
Aha. I'm just cutting everybody. This is awesome. This, these gauntlets are actually way too good. Oh, I love them. They're, they're really sexy. Now I get the key. Uh, because this area will be filled with water later for some stuff, if I remember correctly. There that I'm not remembering correctly, and I'm just stupid. Can't climb up there. Is there a block puzzle here, or do I just not remember certain things? Can I go anywhere with this? No. It was all for naught. I am really liking this thing that I'm now noticing with the, the color scheme. The whole, there is no light in this world. I must bring the light back. It is a, it is a pretty cute idea. It is honestly really interesting and- oh shit! I'm telling you, this game has so many fucking combos, it's actually kind of ridiculous. Also, there is a Savage Crawler. Die. Oh, everything's dead. Cool. Don't make me fight a thinny. I don't want to fight another thingy. They hurt. A lot. They really, really painful. Okay. Uh, okay. The chest is up there. And then another one is in an alcove over yonder. And if you don't know what that was that I just whistled, uh, you should go to hell. No, I'm kidding. That was the Wanda Rionda theme song because Wanda Rionda. Okay. None of two already? Damn. I have been taking damage. Like nobody's business. Okay. Well, um, can't run over there. Can't go up. Gotta go over here. And jump. And jump. Now we just go over here and then up down and then uh chest. But more importantly, is there anything besides chest? No. Great. Anything good? No. It'd probably make me look cool. So I gotta go over there. Okay. Really? Really, death? Do you not know how to roll off of the ledge? What? What just happened? Ah! Here it is. This is the one I wanted. Oh, which I mean the ball segment that I was thinking of earlier at some point in my past. And here we go. Oh, I thought I'd be Break it. That was like supposed to bust through. Like. Oh, well, shit. It didn't bust through. Uh, which means now I gotta figure out where the fuck the bombs are. Problems. I don't know where the bombs are. Are they up there? There. Yep. Blowies. Blowies! Glowies are gone! And ball goes into the corner pocket! Corner pocket. First try! And now... Ah! I almost thought I was not recording anymore. That was scary. 
Now back to your regular, regularly scheduled stupid bitch playing video games. Already in progress. Which I need to fuck. Problem. I needed a bomb. I don't have a bomb. How am I supposed to climb up if I don't have a bomb? Yeah. Because he can't go that one extra foot. <laughs> Hell, six inches. No, actually probably three. Uh, so the problem is I need a bomb. Again. Which means I need to get up there. Somehow. Magically. Oh, it's over there. Oh, that was in a different area. I'm dumb. Okay. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this bomb. And we are going to throw it right about that. And now we're on this thing. And now we just go like this. Yay! Super smart. Bust through the door. Wall of the door. Roll again! Yeah, oh yeah. They also have no distance on them, which is a little disgusting, but whatever. Okay, so now we just gotta kill the Slayer thingy. I should have gotten something fire related because holy shit, it would have been better. But needless to say, yeah, these things are weak to fire and they will actually take burn damage. It's pretty cool, pretty sexy, pretty legit. And now they're all dead. Problem, I am low on health again. The room might actually heal me. I don't know. And we never will. Needless to say, I need another. Oh wait, no, I don't. I can just go like this. Whee! Let me rephrase that. Whee! Okay. And now I, um... Pull this lever! And now I... Jump in the pristine water of happiness and tranquility. Now we look for those parts where we can climb the wall. Typically over somewhere over here. Because we need to pull that lever too. So here's the area that we were originally in. Guess what we're going to do? Remember that place that I couldn't climb? We're going to climb it! Because now, we have the height to do it. And now, we go over here. Good job, Death. Good job. There we go, that's what I wanted to do. Okay. And now we... Pull this lopper. And yay, we have a second thingy. Now all of the water will be in the central area. What does that do? I don't know if I can remember. Don't they do with dicks? I mean, let's see. So that's now all leveled. And water going into that place. Is the gate gonna open or something? Oh no, there's a door that's now open. Cool. And something slammed. I don't know what the hell that was. But let's go behind door number one, two, three, two. <laughs> Yes. So, behind that door is a boss. Can you tell there's a boss? There might be a boss. Can you tell there's a boss? So, 
Uh, first thing we're doing is jumping in here, because I think there might be a chest underwater. I'm not entirely sure. There might be something down here. There might not be. Well, shit. Well, I guess this was just if you entered this area early, then. That was the system to fucking get out of this room, and it tells you, oh, you're not supposed to be in this room yet. So, let's do a safety save. And fight a weird bug thingy. Who sucks? I mean, the boss sucks. I mean, it, it's a dumb fight. You have to, like, knock her out with her own eggs, and then when she's knocked out, fucking hit her, and it's just stupid and dumb, and... Meanwhile, when you- oh yeah, that's the best part. When you hit her with her eggs to knock her out, the eggs also hatch. So it's like, you get X amount of time to hit her, but she will also fucking spawn shit. Like that. Uh -huh. So you gotta do shit like this. Meanwhile, right now she's stupid. Because she's stupid. Okay, so now we kill this thing. Okay, and now we hurt Big Mama. And our fleshy vagina. And unfortunately, you actually have to do this X amount of times. There is no, like, special limit thing. Also, how the fuck did she knock herself out instead of killing me? Also, how the fuck did that of all things hurt. So, fleshy underside, we hit. And she angry with us. Big Mama wants to kill. Or Big, oh fuck me, that's right. Big Mama does this fucking thingy with thingies and it's annoying. But if you just go around in a circle like a fucking asshole, it will never touch you. Haha, -ha, because she's stupid as shit. See, stupid as shit. Meanwhile, I fight the earth crack. Fine. You see why I love that god for Satan fucking forward me so much? Okay. Get out of her vagina. Final attack. Go! Form of stupid tendrils in the ground. Because she's dumb. See? Dumb. See how dumb she is? Dumb! Olay! And boom. Oh, holy shit, you've actually attacked me. That is new. And now, we slice her open. We give her an eight-way cut vagina of death. Not because it kills us, it's because it kills her. Master of Cockinus. Guess where that's gonna go? You guessed it, in the possessed weapon. Possibly making it better or worse. I have no fucking clue. But always feed those possessed weapons, children. Where the fuck is it? What the hell? Arcane, critical, don't care. Uh, yes. Hell yes. I'll take that. Those were gauntlets? Are you serious? Like, for real, real, and not for play play. Oh, shit. Yeah, those were, uh... Oh, no, those were, like... Those, those were attack gauntlets. Those were, like... Save me from the nothing I've become gauntlets. Right, 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 right. Of course. <sighs> Foolish me. 
Holy crap. Okay. So, uh, but it's level 7. So, I'm still possibly, possibly, going to do some stupid bullshit. Or, it doesn't allow me to feed special items in. Well, shit. So, I actually can't feed it that. Awesome. Butter, you fucking waste of time. Okay. Well, you can give me defense, so that's good. That's defense of 18 up, so we'll go with that. And then we'll go with... Yes. Yes. And it will gain a... Strength. Yes. That sounds good means now what we're gonna do is some oh yeah just because of that boost and fucking experience i'm liking that uh no eh fuck it yeah um yeah yeah that makes more sense so then we equip that, and that's still better. Shit. But we're gonna keep fodder on anyway. That's still better. Fuck me. So that'll be the next item. But meanwhile, fodder actually gets some love. Yay! What the fuck am I doing? Pulling a lever? Pulling a lever. Oh shit, what the fuck? I miss you. Still faster, goddamn. Uh, are you serious? What the hell? Is there anything else that's hidden in here that I just don't notice? Is there like eight health potions? No. Why am I not surprised? Let my water go! So now I can fight the first super boss, which is, uh, oh yeah, fast travel, that's a thing, right? Haha, -ha. because the first game really didn't kind of have it. Also, holy shit, the chests are still on the map. I kind of forgot about that. <coughs> Wee! Okay, so now I got to fight a Colossus thingy. Yeah, you heard me. This is about to become Shadow Colossus. Because for some reason, this game and Lords of Shadow decided at around the exact same time, we need to have Shadow of the Colossus properties in our game. Ah. And that's the whole story of why there's Shadow Colossus things in the game. <laughs> Any questions? So there's the water of life, and there's the fire of death. I mean life. I mean both of creation and forge and shit. And here's the super forge. The forge of amazingness. And this is the maker key. It's dumb. I mean, if this was actively taken out of the game, I would be excited. So you're asking yourself, what do Maker Keys do? Well, they allow me to control Maker <sighs> Constructs. It is finished. You know those robots? At long last. Well, we can pilot Death, them. This is a Maker's Key, and you had best take it now, before I come to my senses. What sense, Odin? You seem more likely to lose them, old one. A problem, aye. But there is also a solution. Destroy Lugania, that corruption. Meant to be our greatest weapon and capable of clearing the forest around the tree. Yeah, but an the guardian. Comes from the foundry, and now I fear something else roams within. The guardian was never finished. If the guardian is your masterwork, how am I to complete him? In the forest lies another construct, one of the few remaining who have not fallen to corruption. He is not as vast as the guardian. But his heart is strong. Seek him out, and he will guide you to the foundry. There, you may activate the Guardian using the Maker's Key. 
That sounds stupid. I forgot there's one more dungeon in this area. Also, yay, cool thingy with a thingy. Uh, let us now, even though we had it for two seconds, equip you. And that means into fodder goes these. Look at this thing. Look at this stupid fucking weapon. And you can actually use this near the end of the game, and it is pretty viable. Which is silly. What fucking cave? Can I just, like, fast travel? Is that okay? I didn't even show it on the map. It's like, we don't know what cave you're talking about. There's a thingy. It's glowing. Why is that glowing? It's not like anybody sent me items. Watch, it'll then be like, Dickbot457 has sent you an item. Ah, yes. The fucking lack of anybody. Oh yeah, that's right, the servers are gone, which means if you buy this game now, uh, that's one achievement you will never be able to get. Isn't that great? Haha, -ha. you idiots. Okay, so. This does like in the 50s. The normal attack does 306. And the dash does, oh. Oh, okay, that's totally vital. What the hell? Oh, that's where I came from. Like, at the beginning of the game. I kind of forgot about that. Uh... Hey, you have pots and shit down here. <gasps> Holy fuck! Free health potion refill area. What the fuck? Are you serious? I forget that. No, oh, break that fucking pot. I don't want money. I want health. Give me that sexy fucking health. Dodge, dodge. Dodge, dodge. Dodge, dodge. Dodge, dodge. Well, one dodge. Dodge, dodge. Climb up. Jump down. Roll, roll. Jump down. Oh, I'm insane. Okay, where the hell are we going? Somewhere in the general direction of here. Oh. Oh. Well, okay. So all I know is I kind of just, you know, shoot that eyeball in the, uh, the eye. Like. Like that. No, I actually have to do something with something. Which is silly and stupid. Goddamn game. Fucking making me waste my time. Okay, is this the dungeon I need to go through to go to the thingy? No? No. Cool. This is the dungeon I have to do, period. No? Cool? Cool. Oh yeah, here's Volgram. He's a bitch. And that does mean a bitch. This is the Bane's Wood. It's stupid. Yay. Did I just instantly kill that guy? Would have been fucking hilarious if I had. Oh shit. I almost did. Well, now he's dead. Did he drop a potion? Not of the kind I give a fuck about.
Now, enter of my own volition. So, how the hell is this dungeon work? I don't remember. Seriously, do none of you fucking assholes like to drop health potions? Did other adventurers come here and just take them all? Like, I just, I don't get it. Ooh, yes. Yes. So that's Maker. He can create chains. And we put them into slavery for our own use. Don't think too much into it. This is aim mode. Aim mode is now done. Get used to that fucking animation. You will be seeing it for the rest of the goddamn game. Where the fuck am I? Oh shit. Okay. Pretty good. That is pretty good. Yes. No, you don't get to throw shit. You think you can throw stuff? You think you can do something with your life? Fools. Also, I think there's a health potion up there. <gasps> no, there are shoes. Non-viable shoes. <gasps> I need bombs. Bombs are always good. Sneezing's also good. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sneezing's good. Sneezing always helps make the world go round. Okay. Give me something good, please. Um. Health on crit. That sounds advertising. If only I could do it for something good. Okay. Time to upgrade you. Uh. We'll put you in for fodder. Um, critical chance might be good for a hammer. Just for the lulls. I mean... Yeah. Fuck it. Uh, no. Yeah. Or... Ah, uh, sure. And now it's done upgrading. Now we can't get it any higher, but, and this is the big but, holy shit, it brings defense to the roof. We will be using that possessed item to feed into another possessed item later. So that is the general notion. That is how this will work throughout the remainder of the game. It's pretty legit. That was not the way I wanted to go. Well, shit. Just, just, just drop into the pit, why don't you? <laughs> fucking idiot death. You fucking moron. Fucking stupid piece of shit. But Phoebe, wasn't it your problem that I did it? Oh, shut up. You don't know anything. You don't know me. Okay. Thought there was something up there. It turned out there wasn't. Is there anything in here? No, it's a shortcut. Is this the area I think it is? With the, like 800 fucking bugs? Yeah.
Look at that attack. Holy shit. Fucking chance for critical, huh? <laughs> Holy shit. Clearly critical chance on a hammer is uh, actually a little broken. A little dumb since the blade should be the things that get the thing. But I'm okay either way. So what to do, what to do, what to do. Can't go to there. Uh, is this something I can do? Maybe? Aha! Aha! Yes. No? You are not good. Oh, this is a chest for later. This is when I get my three deaths. Which means this is a chest for much later in the game. Holy shit. That's stupid. Everything is stupid. Timmy with an eye, you're stupid. Fucking shit, that's awesome. 1,000 from my fucking protocol. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Fuck the police, right? Just killing everything. Ooh! Where did you come from? You're dead anyway. Uh, let's go down here. Seems safe. Famous last words. Okay, is there anything down here of note? Anything cool? Anything worth it? Anything at all. I have high hopes for nothing at all. If you don't know what that is, you should listen to Sulak. It's a pretty good band. Needless to say, holy shit. No, oh, Boatman's game. Boatman's the name. Is that it? Ah, whatever. What goes down must come up anyway. Time to go up. God, that is a really good hammer. That is a really fucking good hammer. What the hell? My phone went off. Ah, the person noted me. Good. Fantastic. stuck in my glasses. That's awesome. One that bad thing about having product in your hair and putting in sausage curls or whatever. Yeah. Oh, fuck me that door. That is the all 40 uh, pages of the book of the dead door. Whatever is behind this door, getting in won't be easy. Yeah. It's actually a really, really shitty item. Like... It's a shitty item. What the fuck are you? What are those stones? That's what we call the stone of construct sentinels, to be specific. Okay. Uh, I. Yeah, sure. I assume that had to do with the stalker bone I got earlier. Also, fuck that, because I see a thing over here. Haha. 
Probably nothing good. Oh, shit. I can have thorns? Fuck that. Yes. I didn't know thorns was in this game. I forgot about that. Okay, so no, uh, thorns is... Uh, enemies take damage whenever they damage you. If they contact, make contact with your body, you hurt them because they're dumb. Holy shit, you guys hate me. Ha ha. So yeah, while I'm taking damage, and I do mean a lot of damage that I do not want to be taking right now, at the same time, I am hurting everybody on the screen. Also because of the fucking, uh... The fact that I've got a fucking hammer with an area of effect damage. Hi there. And you're dead. Oh, hi. Well, I can get rid of the one I had. And I still have four. This is turning out better than expected. She says not my four walls, she might just die. And then here, is there anything good? Does that possess scythes? <gasps> possess arm blades? I'll go with that. Also take that wrath potion that I will absolutely never use. In fact, I'll waste it right now. I can't waste it right now. <laughs> they knew! So uh, I'm gonna look at the possessed arm thingies, and I'm gonna give it fodder. Also, possessed arm blades already start with that shit. Look at that and think about that. Just, just, just think. Think about it. Okay, so I need one more thingy. And then shit will go crazy. Oh, wait, no. That means they don't have that. That means it only has... Yeah. Still, critical on hit is pretty good, which means I might get them critical chance, but I can't feed it that. Also, no wonder I'm doing so much damage. Critical chance is 10% and critical damage is 50? Damn! Let me rephrase that. Critical chance because of a talisman or something I have is 13% and my damage is 160. Jesus Christ! Also, I got a note. Another note. Oh, both and message me. That's pretty cool. That's what I ha get for having friends in a community that normally you can't get friends in. I have a lot of high people in my friends list. Not like high as in they're stoned, I mean high as in like I have big, I have friends with big members of communities because I used to have a fucking dude in our page for like 9 years. Also, I decided I'm not getting my dude not. I'm just gonna delete all those DA videos. I mean, I do hate DA right now, but as long as I don't start shit, they won't start shit with me. That's all that matters. Is there a thing I could have hooked the chain to? No. Also, while bombs can destroy it, constructs can destroy it. Their chains can also destroy the corruption. It's pretty funny how everything destroys corruption in this game. But corruption is totally unbreakable. This is a boss fight. Not a boss fight. More of a, uh... These are special enemies that can only be hurt with the gun. Well, are better left for... The gun. Did you forget there was a gun? So yeah, they uh they're floating masks. Surprisingly you don't throw bombs in them like in fucking Zelda. Aha, uh -huh. idiots. Oh shit! Yeah, I forgot they have a laser attack. It kinda hurts. Yeah, this is like a, a weird... I don't know if it's... yeah. It is kind of wave-based, but not really. So yeah, now you know. That was it. That was the whole battle. See? The gun works for shit. And now I have that carbon stone. 
What will I do with it? Probably complete a quest to get experience to level up, which means kind of nothing right now because of the fact that I'm doing Rapping Shelley! Wait, seriously? Uh, I think that's the end of the dungeon over there, or at least part of the end of the dungeon, but I need a construct to be able to get through there. Either that, or I don't know what I'm doing. We. I'm gonna say I should save at some point. But possessed arm blades, upgrade. Ah, uh, feed those, and then feed. No. <coughs> I'd rather those be something that comes later. Actually, better question. Can I feed? Wait, no. Not a dumb, uh, a good question. I already know the answer. I can't feed these into this. Which pisses me off because that critical chance would help with that health on crit. So I still need something that gives me health on crit. And crit up. I more need the crit up than anything else. Which sucks. Oh, is this the dumb one? Or I have to do like the battle right owl using the construct? I think this is the battle royale with the construct. For some reason, saying the word construct makes me want to play Fall of Cybertron. The problem is, my copy of Cyber Fall of Cybertron stopped working after a while and Microsoft was like, nope, we cannot fix it. And what I mean is, I had a physical copy of War for Cybertron. I got all the achievements in War. I was really actually kind of professional level at the fucking multiplayer, specifically with Scout and Medic. And then I decided, I started playing Fall Cybertron, I got a lot of the achievements there, and then I just stopped working. Like, it would, it would literally freeze on this one loading screen. Well, I looked at the thing and I was just like, huh, okay, interesting. So then, no joke, no fucking joke. Uh, targets at a distance. What exactly is the target? There is no target required. That's the target. But, uh... So, I went to a game, a, a game store and I bought a pre-owned copy. I, I do my normal thing, you know. Can I see the disc? And they're just like... Sure, young lady, you can see the disc. And I look at the disc and it's fine. And I pop that into my Xbox. And it stops loading on the exact same frame. And I'm like, huh. So my Xbox doesn't like discs. So then, I, b I brought it back to the game store. You know, fucking thingy and all. The, the fucking thingy with the thingy with the uh, receipt. And then I go and I buy the digital copy. In the digital copy, start working on the same frame. And at this point, I'm like, okay, what the fuck? Because clearly, there's something wrong here. And I don't know what the hell it is, but it's something. And I need to figure out what it is because I want to get these multiplayer achievements and play multiplayer with people and do multiplayer. So. I go, I call Xbox, uh, you know, Microsoft support, bunch of, uh, individuals who may or may not know what the hell they're doing with their jobs because nobody has helped me get the fucking Chariot DLC either, and in fact the last time I made an entire rant video about the fucking 40 year old woman who was working at Microsoft, no, I'm sorry, 80 year old woman who was working at Microsoft, but I digress. So I call. And they are like, ah, oh, yes, ma'am, how are you? And I'm just like, not good. I, uh, I can't get this thing to work, this game. And I bought multiple copies, and I have done this and this and that. And they're like, ha! Huh. 
interesting. And I'm like, yeah. Can you help me out here? So, yeah, you know. Well, we're not sure. And they go and they look through it. And it turns out it's something about the code. Some crazy thing about the code in my Xbox and shit has been rewired. Uh, or, or some weird shit has happened and um, the game is completely unplayable. And I'm like, what do you mean completely unplayable? And they're like, there's no way to fix this, ma'am. We are sorry, your Xbox has just completely abandoned this game and you can never play it. And I'm like, cool. I want a refund. It's just like, of your Xbox? And I'm like, no, of the digital copy of the game, you doofus motherfuckers. And they're just like, ah, yes, yes, we understand, okay, yes. Because we have no idea what we're talking about, and we have no idea what we're doing. So they give me a refund. But long story short, I uh, I can never play Fall of Cybertron ever again on my Xbox 360. It's dead. And the Xbox One version is its own separate game with separate achievements. So fuck that shit. I'm not doing that. Plus, multiplayer on that's probably dead. So uh, I just have achievements I can never get because Microsoft fucking sucks. That's the end of the story. Not to say Sony's any better with the PlayStation uh, Now debacle and all that shit from a couple of years ago, but whatever. <laughs> Nobody can win. There are no winners in the Game of Thrones. Why the hell did I say that? Can you give me anything, like, at all? Okay, well, give that. We'll give that for fun, and then critical chance is what I will feed it. About to do that, yes. Look at that shit. Look at that damage up. Look at that critical chance up. Ah. So, if I equip this right now, Tagamol, that is a 10% chance of crit right now. That's not that bad. However, that looks a hell of a lot better on the right side of the screen. I'd also like to get over there before I end this part, unless Death wasn't gonna put away the gun. He really liked that gun. He likes stroking the gun. He liked Rubbing the shaft of the gun. Oh yeah, here we go. Boom. Give me a chest. With something I'll feed into possessed arms. Oh hi. Oh hi. Also, I just realized something. I should probably look at how much health I actually have before I start going, Yay, possessed armbands! Because it might honestly mean nothing. Yeah, it would take me about 100 strikes to get... No, 50 strikes to get back to full health or some shit. But needless to say, that's still it. Is this going to be a key? I bet I'll be a key. Watch, it's a key. Oh no, I can't get out. Whatever will I do? I don't like that Death can't leap around on the vines like War could, considering that he is supposed to be a hell of a lot more limber than War was. But, whatever. It's life, I guess. What is this? Nah. But, I will take it to feed. Grow my child. I 
Zach, can you see why I like possessed weapons so much? They're pretty fucking good. Also, this thing over there, that's a shortcut. Okay, so uh, next time on Let's Challenge Darksiders 2, the weapons only run. I'm gonna totally check what's behind this door. I bet it's a demon head in demon brain. Look at that demon brain. It's so tiny. See you next time.